Hey guys, so today we're going to take a look at this Eason 3D filament. Um, I contacted Eason just recently and asked them if they happened to have uh, samples that they would be able to hand out because uh, I was really interested in their bronze uh, PLA. Um, as a lot of you know, there's been kind of a shortage uh, when it comes to uh, the Hatchbox, and Hatchbox has been my very favorite when it comes to the, the uh, bronze PLA. Uh, but the thing is, I'm kind of looking for, for a replacement because I, I don't know whether there's, there's supply problems going to get solved or what's going on. Uh, I have no clue what's going on. I've tried to contact them and they haven't got back to me. So uh, what I did is I uh, got hold of son, asked him about a sample, and they were gracious enough to send me an entire roll of it. Now this roll is, let's see here, it's 0.5 kilogram. So I believe that's going to work out to be just over, was it 1.1 pounds, I believe. So just over a pound of PLA. Uh, so it's a little bit smaller spool than what I'm used to. But uh, it actually looks pretty cool. Uh, it's got a cool, uh, a uh, clear spool. It's got the desiccant, and it appears to be vacuum packed. Let me grab my little knife here. There we go. Yep. Definitely heard the air rush in. <laughs> it looks a lot it looks a lot like the PLA from Hatchbox. Actually I believe it's a little bit a little bit different color. Hang on for just a moment. Okay so there is the Hatchbox. Hatchbox is a little bit different in color, but not by much. It's just a little darker, it looks like. Pretty close, though. On camera, it looks really close. But uh, we're going to go ahead and give it a shot, see how it prints, um, and I will see you at the... Oh, and I'm going to print this owl that I found on Thingiverse. It's by my friend Mustang Dave. Um, it's called... Uh, the. I believe it's called Owl Statue Number 3 is what it is. I'll put a link to it in the video description. Anyway, I'll get this set up, and I'll see you at the end of the time lapse. Hey guys, so this took 7 hours and 14 minutes to print. And as you can see, it turned out pretty good. This was point, printed at uh, point 0.1 layer height. I uh, might have had a little bit of over extrusion to it, just a hair. But not horribly bad. But all in all, it printed really good. Uh, this model printed with no uh, supports. I had a little bit, a couple little strands here that I went ahead and I pulled off. And I had a little stringing right between there, which I went ahead and pulled it off as well. But uh, that's, once again, that's retraction and, and uh, heat settings. But all in all, this is a very nice looking PLA. It's, uh, the sheen's a little bit different from what I'm used to with the hatch box, but still it's a very nice, very nice print. It really prints well. Uh, it actually, with the Me Creator 2, I think it runs about 10 degrees hotter than, than my other printer. So on the package it says between uh, 180 and uh, 210. And I actually had to print it at 175, I bet I could have went down to 170 and it would have uh, actually printed better probably. But anyway, that's uh, definitely a filament that I'm going to continue using. <laughs> I've used some other uh, Esun filaments in the past, but this is my first time using their bronze. 
So I'm definitely going to be uh, going to continue using their bronze. It looks really cool. Once again, this bronze was uh, furnished to the channel for free by Esun. Um, I was not paid for this, and uh, no money exchanged hands that way. All that happened is they just uh, sent me the roll of PLA to try out, and I have to say I'm impressed with it. So guys, that's going to do it for this one. Have a great day and take care. Hey guys, thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, please subscribe. I sure appreciate it. You can do that by clicking on the link over here. Don't forget to ring the bell too. That way you'll be notified when a video comes out. Also, if you'd like to support the channel, please click on my Patreon page over here. You can support the channel from there. If you'd like to check out one of my other videos, please give these a shot. I think you're going to love them. Oh yeah, you're going to like them. Have a great day and take care. Bye.